Let's go. Oh my God. Look at this. This is what the Expendables has been reduced yes. to from its glory days <laughs> to this. And come on. Come on in. Come on in. Hey. Hey. Oh. Hey friends, welcome back to another episode of Bad Movie Date. I'm Ankit. I'm Munir. And Munir is not happy. He's not a happy camper right oh. now. This man thought Expendables 4 would be this film that just like is so creative, breaks and all barriers. Is that too much to ask for? When you're talking about an Expendables movie, yes. Oh. We're about to watch, or we did watch Expendables Part 4. Uh, the, the fourth movie in the long running Expendables series that started in 2010. Mm -hmm. And when it, when a movie gets to like a fourth entry, I think at that point, you just gotta say it's, it's enough is enough. Like if you just took out the Expendables title from the na like from the movie, it, it, it would have been fine. This was such a basic kind of rudimentary, just insert into the action genre. And given how, when this franchise started, you know, what, what it was positioned to be and how it was kind of this fun homage to the action stars of yesterday. yesterday. Yeah. Um, to see what it has become. It's, it's like really disappointing. Also, Anka thinks that Steven Seagal's in this movie. <laughs> he is. Let, him, let, <laughs> let the word be known that he was convinced. Listen, Expendables 5, Steven Seagal, he's been here the whole time. <laughs> Roll it. I, I, wow, we are gonna be watching The Expendables 4 as or it's uh, as it's written, expend fourables. Expend fourables. Yeah, they, yes. they did the fantastic four. Fan four <laughs> fan fantastic treatment. That's not yeah. a good sign. Cut our See? losses and stop it now. Yeah. Let's just watch a good movie. <laughs> okay. So watch Expendables One. Yes. I liked Expendables One. Yeah. Like it, it it is what it is. You know, I was like, yeah, it's gonna be a, like a brain dead action movie with a bunch of legendary action stars, and that's what it was. Right. You know, the Expendables movies don't need any introduction. It was a cool idea when it came out in 2010. Yes. And at that point, the actors in it were really pushing like past their prime. Yes. But it was supposed to be like this one last hoorah mm -hmm. for them. Omar, what's the status on the general? Here we are in Libya. You know, can't uh, can't start off a, a movie like this without being in the Middle East. Did we or... just put on a Seagal movie accidentally? Oh shit, we might have. Uh, <laughs> just see Seagal show. <laughs> oh, he would be perfect in these movies though. That's Don't actually a good it? point. Why isn't he in any of these movies? Please, calm down. Oh, me calm down? Oh, oh my God, really? I heard, I heard she was in this. Do you not remember the great action films of the Megan Fox era? No, <laughs> Transformers 1. Oh, right. <laughs> Who could forget? I think MGK is going to show us some oh, good morning. Yeah, that would be amazing. He should be a villain or something. <laughs> or like a goon. Cigar. <laughs> or not Cigar. <laughs> Stallone. <laughs> Stallone. <laughs> Bro, I, I get it, okay? <laughs> I was we gonna love that man. So much. I was gonna say Stallone breaks MGK over his knee, but Sigal just Sigal doing it. that would actually be better. Why are we here? I lost my ring last night in a bet, and I'm here to try to buy it back. Seriously? Barbara, there's uh, only two of you. He's gonna fight a bunch of bikers. Eight of us, yeah, with they're gonna be playing pool. <laughs> you used to be strong, what happened? And you used to be hairy. What happened? Things change. This is such a boomer humor. I just feel. Now I see why they call him Jumbo. No, the other guy, second guy. Uh, it's a little harsh. Bite size. Barney wants his ring back. What did you call me? Are they all gonna fight him? I guess so. Okay. He's gonna beat them all down. Watch them all attack one at a time. Mm -hmm. And watch him just take them apart. <laughs> Yep, line them up, line them up. Just one at a time, boys. Just one. Everyone's raining haymakers. Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> hey, is this a new guy? Hey, it's easy day. <laughs> 50 Cent, bro. Didn't you remember the 50 Cent video game that he did? Uh, uh, yeah. On the PS2. Mm -hmm. So he falls into this category. Your mission is to make sure the detonators stay there. All right? That's all I got. Good luck. Barney, keep him tucked. I'll do my best. I'd imagine <laughs> writing the screenplay for this. It's like every 10 lines, there needs to be some witty, you know, tongue in cheek <laughs> reference. You're right, man. I could just see the old man laughing at this. You know what he's a golden shower? You know what he's a golden shower? You look like the type who has had one before. I'm I could tell this guy's gonna be annoying. Oh my God, yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. That looked like a direct hit. 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 Yes. Like, it, like your whole be, thing, should your be, propeller should be gone. gone. It's intact. <laughs> Do they have some sort of force field? Some old Shields 1920s activate. force field? <laughs> activate ray shield. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> like, <laughs> Stallone's sitting right next to me. Yeah, right. Look at this PS2 graphics. Dude. What the fuck? I mean, if you're gonna do an action movie, you gotta, you gotta add some realism. I know. Off it's because he's sober now. How much you want to bet he's gonna have to have a, like a little bit of a drink later in the movie and he's gonna just You gotta drink this! Wow. Dude, the movie's just started. This feels like the, uh, the climax of the movie right now. <laughs> Is it almost over? We're just starting, bro. We're just starting. 50 Cent has not done anything yet. <laughs> oh, there he is. Yeah, speaking of the devil. Oh, is he the heavy? Oh, okay. Wow, oh, look how strong he is. Nobody believes this. All right, Curtis Jackson. Initial success. Coming in. Good job, Curtis. I just love the instant cut to him being upside down. He wasn't even like disoriented by the fact that his car was like lifted upside down. He was just immediately in the position. Didn't you, didn't you do a whole music video upside down? Oh yeah, oh my God, yes. There has to be some like more references too. At some point he's gonna like grab like a cane and be like, it's the magic stick. <laughs> I remember that about uh, Expendables 2, I believe. That's the one with Chuck Norris. Remember there was like a time on the internet where oh. Chuck Norris memes were all over the place? Yes. They dropped specific lines in the script. Yeah. Saying stuff like Chuck Norris is so powerful he can do blank, like that sort of humor. Yeah. I'm not even joking. I think it was the line, right? Uh, when they first meet Seagal or Seagal. <laughs> God damn it! You're having a complete breakdown, bro. You're, you're losing it. <laughs> He's infected my mind. Do, do you want me to watch? Do you want to watch the Seagal movie, bro? Just say yeah. it. It's fine. Just, just tell me, and Listen. I'll do it. I'm out of flares. Get him in slow mo. What? Where are you running? <laughs> like you're gonna catch him? <laughs> catch the plane? <laughs> bro, he, he made it through the warehouse so quickly. Oh, dead, dead, deader than dead. No way. But see, I can't, I can't even pay attention to his death because of how bad it that looks. animation looked. It was horrific. And the fact that he made it there that fast, he was like thousands of miles. He up sprinted in the air. through that entire warehouse. And the, the fact that it was going down, like accelerating. No way. Is this supposed to be some sort of fake out? Like, who else he was you by himself? Well, I don't know. I don't think he's dead. You don't think I he's don't, because they didn't show him in the plane as it was going down. I think in any scenario, if he was actually dying, they would have cut to him trying to like. But think about balance it, it out. That too. He was the only person on the plane, as far as we know. He looked like he was wearing the same getup. Yeah, and, and the ring, and the was... and the ring, and the gloves. And uh, you would think they like checked the body. Is it? So I'm think I'm thinking he's dead. He's probably dead. All right. Battle lines have been drawn. Yes. <laughs> I am calling team, it. Team, he's alive. And I'm team. He's Third dead. act. Hey. Everything's going to shit. They need a rescue. He's going to parachute Boom. down. <laughs> so what are we going after the guys that did this? You ain't going nowhere. You're done. This is a bad joke. Well, you disobeyed a direct order from your superior, and that causes the mission, so you're out. I missed the part where you disobeyed. You guys were like, there wasn't even a plan. It was like a free for all. Like, what are you talking about? Mm -hmm. What could he have possibly done that was so out of line? I guess because he ran back to go get him instead of chasing You're not supposed to do that. Private security detail, a social media influencer. <laughs> social media influencer. Stop. In the magazine. <laughs> You're not going to find a an... like that on a magazine. Oh my god! This is this is a boomer's idea of like yes. what a yes influence. They heard that yep. word once and they're like, I think I know <laughs> what they're like. He's holding the camera vertically. That's how you know a boomer wrote this. Right, <laughs> yeah, that's how you know a boom. And it's on Facebook. Those are the Facebook icons. Ooh, this is dude. just wrong. I'm so levels. <laughs> I'm offended. I'm more offended about this than Stallone. <laughs> yes, getting burnt to a crisp. Going somewhere, are we? 
We're going after the guy that got Barney. You know, for a while, I heard they were going to make an Expend the Bells movie. Really? Didn't you hear about this? No. About Ronda Rousey and like her. <laughs> and it was like on ice for the longest time. So maybe they were like, if we can't do the movie, at least we could like bring her in. Right. And have her be a part of this. Expend the Bells. No one's starting. I always liked this tattoo. So did your brother. It was my foreplay that was like this. No, it's not. No, no, we're not doing jujitsu <laughs> in the kitchen. <laughs> Put your girlfriend in the arm bar. <laughs> we're gonna get the guy that did this to Barney. I promise. What are you even worried? He's alive. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think they would go through all this trouble for them to reveal that he's gonna be alive at the end? It just doesn't make sense. I think um, it's because earlier Seagal said, <laughs> I'm, "I'm just gonna stop. I'm just gonna stop." <laughs> Look, they both have X in their name. Wait, the expend the bells is happening. <laughs> no, shut up. Was this it just? Was no, it? that's not Megan Fox. That was somebody else. So yeah. Stallone, Stallone. I think you, you can you can try to correct yourself all you want, bro. I'm gonna try to edit around this. <laughs> it's embedded into the video. You Sa can't. Stallone. Yeah, yeah, just, <laughs> just my voice over. Like an AI generated voice. <laughs> Stallone. We're gonna halo in. Team Alpha is gonna secure the bridge while Bravo searches and sweeps the boat. We're gonna identify, kill, capture both Ocelot and Ramit. I'm I'm not buying this at all. <laughs> you don't even know her general authority. She's a woman. Nope, I'm not doing that. Okay. <laughs> See that, folks? See that? <laughs> <laughs> it's Megan Fox, bro. Does it work? Oh my God. Look at this. This is what The Expendables has been reduced yes. to from its glory days <laughs> to this. Bro, Seagal's not in this movie, okay? You don't have to check. I promise you. I'm just I checking the name I of one of the actors. Okay? Jeez. <laughs> You've given me every reason. It's a question. <laughs> My entire search history. Where, where is Steven Seagal in Expendable 4? It's a ghost town in here. No, put your weapons down now! What a fucking mess this turned out to be. Oh, they got captured. Let me guess. Just Megan Fox led them. She, they got captured. I know. I know. Listen, all I'm saying is Barney wouldn't have allowed us <laughs> Regardless of his gender. I see you're trying to get us a new demographic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, trying to, I'm trying to reach out to everyone here, okay? <laughs> this movie's fucking woke, bro. Why is this movie so horrible to look at? <laughs> what a statement. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the best way I could put it. It's just so unpleasant to watch. So you can bring him, aren't they? Bring all the fucking men you want. Now what to every last one of them. I don't think that was a good idea to give away his position. Nope. He had the element of surprise yeah. on his side the whole time. Mm -hmm. He just, he had to say the one-liner, you know? He had to, he couldn't help himself. He was lit. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> that, oh that, that looks like a bomb. Yep. So maybe don't get into a shootout. Are these guys stupid? That guy's taking cover behind a nuclear bomb. Oh my God. What an idiot. Of course it's functional. Mm -hmm. Yep, gassed up, ready gassed to go. Up, ready to go. Oh, oh, and it comes with turrets. Dual mounted turrets on the front of the <laughs> Where have you seen that? Again, There's no way you should not be able to hit him. I know. It's like it's a so corridor. Yes. And he has to like turn slowly and he's a big target. Like any bullet will like take him out. Bro, his kill count is insane. Imagine how bad the other expendables feel. Right? You guys got caught in the first 10 seconds. They sent an entire team to like do all this essentially. What? Build system. An emergency clears water from the ship's dry areas. What? If it gets wet, it'll open. Well, anybody got to pee? A little privacy, please. Oh, 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 stop. I can't, bro. It's, it's, oh, <laughs> God. <laughs> writing. The writer's room. <laughs> All right, never crawl through the piss tunnel. Yeah. Oh, look at, look at the drip. Oh. Yes, it does like golden showers. Oh, oh, man. Oh, man. 
Hey kid, we should watch Expendables 4. Oh my god. <laughs> you know? You, that's you. I'm goofy? Yeah, you goofy. <laughs> Damn it. Fuck right into that. No, the Pope don't shit in the woods. Or next door bed. Why you gotta say shit like that? What's this fight? I mean, we were getting so angry. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Turn it down. Let's go. Fuck it. Oh. What did you say? What did you say? You called it. You said that he was going to have a moment where he's going to drink some, uh, like, alcohol and go back to his old ways. I got to give you that, bro. Stallone is alive. <laughs> Uh, it's becoming more and more likely. <laughs> I've gone from 99% <laughs> yeah. to 70. This device right here is the only thing preventing World War III, a conflict that will devastating for many, insanely profitable for somebody, and that somebody is going to be me. Oh, uh, so evil. So evil. The business of war. But it just became daylight I, out of nowhere. Dude, that was, <laughs> it was so fast. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now you know why the sequence took place at night. Because, good God, <laughs> this is horrible. <laughs> ah, oh. Stop. Stop doing this scene. Just cut to them all on the boat. Danger. Stop. No. Stop. The this, shadow and lighting effects are so off. There's not even a sense of like trying to stay balanced <laughs> yeah. on the water. Everyone's just <laughs> stiff as a board. Like I'll be seeing you soon, Barney. What's happening? Bro. Bro. Something is happening. Oh, no. Don't, 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 don't do this. Don't do this. You, you can't. You can't. I can't take this. You almost fucking killed me. You're welcome. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. <laughs> Would you ever? <laughs> Would you ever <laughs> disrespect me again like that? How? How? How is not important, Manier? It's, it's <laughs> in. It's... <laughs> you explain how. You know all this is going to happen. You explain how. Go ahead. 25 years ago, we were doing a covert op, and eight of my team got wiped out. I had to fake my own death to open up a classified file. Driving Marsh out of hiding so I could prove he's ocelite. No. You have to explain. It's done. He explained you have it. to it's explain. Done. How you switched bodies. <laughs> it's done. That's semantics. Oh my Manier. god. Semantics. This the is... important part is I was right. <laughs> I was right. I need to know. Who the corpse is? Exactly. You ever wonder what happened to Jumbo Shrimp? You have got to be shitting me. Of course. Of course. No one saw this. Of that course. jumbo shrimp guy just stole his ring. And he chased <laughs> him to death. Holy shit. I, it's like clicking. I was like, wait, what did he do? That was so bad. Like, you have to do a DNA test. You have to like identify the body when you when something like this happens to make sure. Okay. All that aside, this was awful. That was horrible. That was shit. That sucked. Okay. Wow. How has the franchise just come to this? I don't know. Just shit jokes, okay? Like, the stakes couldn't have been any less, like, uh, insignificant. You know? No. It was nuclear bomb, but I just didn't care. No. I just didn't care. Because they're in the middle of the ocean. It's not like they're in the city or, like, in a suburban area. And they gave you no um, reason to be in fear. The no. good guys never got hurt. They barely got a scratch on them. Randy Stewart got stabbed, but he survived. He was uh, totally fine. Yes. Obviously, we can't show the entire sequence, but there's, like, I think it was, like, 20 minutes of just Jason Statham just tearing through mm -hmm. the ship. My main thing with this movie is it lost the essence of why they even made the Expendable movie yes. in the first place. It was about like bringing back the old guard. And even though Expendables 2 and 3 weren't like great movies, there was that little like bit where it was like, oh, yo, Jean-Claude Van Damme is back. Chuck Norris. You got Mel Gibson. They had Harrison Ford at one point. Um, it felt like what you would feel when you watch like an all-star game mm -hmm. where you bring in all these like main characters into one movie. Yes. Like that was the appeal. Yeah. And 
you know, you're at the fourth movie at this point and you get it like 50 cents. Like, no, no disrespect to him, obviously, but like, it just doesn't, he doesn't belong. Right. He does not belong. Make yeah. it Fox. So, yeah, it has strewn so far from the original vision. Woo! Well, that's it for that. <laughs> that was a good, that was a good one. That was a good one. Yeah. Uh, Once again, I was right. Let nobody forget that. <laughs> nobody should ever doubt me. <laughs> and, um, Hope you enjoyed. I hope you enjoyed. Hope like, you comment, enjoyed. subscribe. Tell us what your uh, your favorite action movie is. Mm. That's a good one. Uh, in the comments below. Well. I'd, like yeah. I'd like to see your, your guys' opinions. So that's it for us. Thanks again for watching. And thanks for hanging out. I think I deserve an apology. Huh? I think I deserve a parade. You deserve nothing. <laughs> you thought it was Steven Seagal the whole time. post credit scene. There must be something. Imagine. The vindication you would have. I would... Like, tear this room apart. <laughs> brick by brick. If that-